And now, your Storm Team 18 forecast. Weather from where you live. Are not too bad tonight. I mean, it's 74 at 1. We're down to 66 by 7 o'clock tomorrow morning. Mostly clear to clear skies. The humidity kind of held in check. It's not going to be overly muggy uh, for tonight. Winds out of the southwest. They are your low 64 Frankfurt, 66 Lafayette, 67 Fowler, and low 60s at Logansport. When you get all this dry air, it cools off pretty efficiently at night. And also kind of a pale, hazy sky. Not only with time this evening, but tonight and into tomorrow as the wildfire smoke from these big fires burning near Flagstaff has wrapped up and around our expanding heat dome or upper ridge again, and that smoke will be coming in. So you'll notice a little hazier sky uh, come tomorrow with some of that smoke several thousand feet up kind of blurs out the sun just a hair, but it's still going to be a very hot day. Look at that. Uh, southwest wind will be nice, but it'll feel more like a furnace than necessarily a nice cool fan. 99 the high, highs 96 to 100. Here's the thing about tomorrow. The heat index will match the temperature because dew points are only going to be running in the 50s and 60s. So the humidity is pretty low tomorrow. Granted, it is going to be brutally hot. It will be a dry heat though. 100 at Morocco, 98 Monticello, 98 Flora, and 96 at Kokomo. Wednesday, it's humid early in the morning as a very weak cold front comes through with a very isolated shower or storm. Otherwise, it dries out in the afternoon. It heats up, winds from the northwest, and a high of 97 after a low of 77 in the morning. And there you see the highs at 93 to 98 viewing area wide. Here's the front coming through on Wednesday. This is 8 o'clock in the morning. Nothing more than a small isolated shower or a very small little thunderstorm. That is it. We're going to have to wait a while to get much in the way of any chance of storms in here. It'll be hot much of the week, hot into the weekend. The dew points low, so the heat index not out of control. But this is our chance to get... Uh, perhaps a couple isolated storms. Most of the storm action is going to be up here. Uh, Saturday and Sunday, kind of a complex of storms riding up and around the ridge. And there'll be a little cold front back here. If we're lucky, we'll get a storm or two out of that. Otherwise, it's just a lot of dry weather that's settling in, and this flash drought will continue to worsen. I talk about that in the latest Storm Team 18 a blog post right now. You want to look at that because I've got the latest forecast for the rain and the heat from now right up through August and September. And you can get that also at WLFI.com. Normal's 84, 99 tomorrow, 97 Wednesday, maybe an isolated morning shower storm, 93 Thursday, but 62 Thursday night due to the dry air. Temperatures fall at night, 97 Saturday, couple storms. That's it Sunday morning and dry Monday with 90. And unfortunately, you know, if we don't get any storm action here, it's dry much of next week.